Assalamu alaikum dear children today we will we will do exercise 8 question number 5 and the simplify simplification is there in this exercise and the expression given is 5a minus square bracket 3b minus parent minus uh, braces 4a within the braces minus parenthesis stars 5b in the parenthesis the f very first term is 5b minus 6a minus 7b and having a win column upon it 7a minus 7b the very last bracket the symbol which comes first so this is the whole expression you have to solve all the brackets are there uh, the win column parenthesis braces and the square bracket so we will solve win column first then bra uh, parenthesis then braces then square bra bracket when i say we will solve win column first it means whatever the function we have to do under the win column we have to do it first then after doing after finishing the win column we will do the functions inside the parenthesis if there are if it has got inside um, some uh, uh, variables which are same so like terms can be added or subtracted if not we will take out all the terms with the outer sign given with the parenthesis so let's start 5a minus the square bracket bring all the terms and brackets and signs in the next step down so minus we will not solve this bracket because we have got a bracket which comes very first that is win column now look under the win column we have got a sign which is negative and two unlike terms so write down 6a and change the sign of minus into plus and write down the la last term 7b then parenthesis closed braces closed and square bracket closed this is in this step we remove the win column and we change the sign under the win column which was negative now it is positive in the next step we will see what is inside the <coughs> parenthesis so inside the parenthesis look keep this sequence you will not miss any of the term inside the parenthesis we have 5b and 7b plus 5b plus 7b so we have to add the like terms because both has got the positive sign plus 7b arranging first <clears throat> and in the next step we will solve 5a again look minus sign then square bracket 3b minus sign don't miss anything brace uh, braces 4a minus inside the bracket two b's are there 5 plus 7 is 5 plus 7 is 12 b minus 6 a so you did the solution in this step in the next step we will take out both the terms because they are unlike terms and now we cannot simplify them so we will take out with this negative sign from the bracket 5 a minus square bracket 3 b minus braces 4a stop minus plus is minus 12b minus into minus is plus 6a 
minus minus is plus 6a. Now you are finished with the parenthesis and we are left with braces and a square bracket. 5a in the next step minus square bracket 3b minus. Now look inside the braces you have got 2a, two terms which are alike. 4a plus 6a. So add them, arrange them, then add them. Arrange in one step. You will have an extra step to do, but you will never miss anything. So do your question correctly. Don't miss any sign. Don't miss any bracket. Don't miss any function. So, 4a plus 6a gives you 10a minus 12b braces square bracket. We just solve the two like, uh, terms which are like terms and then uh, write, uh, write down the next term which is with the variable b. So, we will not remove the braces. We did a function inside the bra bracket with the like terms. Now, in the next step, we will remove this, these braces with this outer sign, which is negative. Remember, when the outer sign is negative, inside all terms will alter their signs. Plus minus is minus an A and minus minus is plus 12B. Now, you are left with only square bracket. Inside the square bracket, C, two like terms are there whose variable is b, we will arrange them and solve them first in the square bracket 3b plus 12b minus minus 10a. Now, we are finishing this question inside the square bracket, look, 3b and 12b gives you, both are positive gives you 15b minus 10a. Now, take out both the terms with this negative sign out of the bracket. 5a plus minus is minus 15b minus minus is plus 10a. So, all the brackets are finished. Now, you will do what? Arrange like terms 5a plus 10a minus 15b. 10 plus 5 gives you 15a minus 15b. Anything common? Again, I'll question you. So, can you see anything common in both the different terms? So, 15 is common. We will take out 15 out of the bracket. Again, introducing uh, the parenthesis and inside the parenthesis we have got only two variables 1a and 1b so when you will multiply 15 with 1 so you will get 15a again and when you will multiply 15 with 1b you will get 15 minus 15b again so this is the simplified answer for the question thank you so much